hello, and welcome back to episode 19. So I've been sitting here for 10 minutes, watching some YouTube videos, letting the spiders build up. Uh, I think there's like 80 in here, 80, 85, 87, somewhere around there. You can see in the, up here it says entities, that's how many mobs there are. I think that's 83 entities. I could be totally wrong though. I have no idea. But anyway, let's see how much experience I get from killing all these guys. Okay, it's, it's taken a while. Game's lagging a little bit. <laughs> so many items and experience orbs. Oh my god, how many are there? I can't even walk in because they shove me back too fast. Hey, did that spider just... Oh, the spiders are climbing the wall and dying. Alright. Okay, so I just went up five levels. And, uh... Yeah. So I'd say this is pretty successful. Because I was only like ten minutes standing there. And, uh, yeah. So that's neat. Um, once I've got both this one and the skeleton one working... It'll be fantastic, and I'll never want for experience again. <laughs> I'll just be able to stand between the two. Because I have noticed that it is a 16, like, it, you have to be within 16 blocks of the spawner. But, um, it's, it is a 16 block wide, why didn't that one, must have landed on another spider. Um, it is a 16 block diameter sphere, so... I discovered that because I was thinking it was going to be 16 blocks down, and then 16 blocks over was how far I could be away from the spawner. But um, actually, this is this is 16 blocks down. I, is that right? Is this 16 blocks down? No, this is 14 blocks down from the sp 15. 15 blocks down from the spawner. 14. I think it's 14. I don't know. I counted at the beginning, but I forget now. Um, but if I'm standing, I forget. If standing on this block will make them spawn. No. I need to be here. On on this block is enough to make them spawn. Um, so, uh, yeah, which I originally had like a little, you know, ah, oh, God. <laughs> That scared me a little bit, not gonna lie. Um, I almost want to fill up this entire thing. I need to get back up there, actually. So I'll pause the video and I'll be right back when I get up there. Alright, so I've lit up this area. So that should stop things from spawning entirely. There are <laughs> quite a few spawned while I was trying to light the place up. So, um, These two spawners, I should be able to... Um, find a way so that I can stand between them down there and still have them work. So I'm going to count how many blocks sideways this is. We got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19 blocks that way, and then like 3 blocks this way. So 1, 2, yeah, it's like two blocks over. Um, I wish I could push these with pistons, but I can't, so, oh well. <laughs> um, let's see, uh, I would love to make lighting, the, like piston lighting in here, but the way that I would normally make the piston lights doesn't work anymore, <laughs> because Glowstone is now a considered a see-through block, a transparent block, and transparent blocks don't um, they don't conduct electricity. So if you try to send a current through one, it doesn't continue onto the other side, which is like the basis of my um, usual on-off lighting pattern or lighting 
circuit because I, I don't I don't normally do lighting like that because I don't usually have a, any place that I need to turn on and off the lights. Uh, usually it's just on all the time. Um, iron. <laughs> like I need more of that. Um, but yeah, so I would love to do that, but I, I just can't right now. So as it is, I'm going to have to leave it like this until I want to come back in and change it. Um, I will be doing the same thing for this one. And I should be able to just make a, like a spiral staircase down here, something that goes all the way down to the bottom, and then comes out like intersecting on that area. Um, like the bottom of this thing actually came right out into the caves that I walk through all the time. Like where I first found those slimes is like right there. So, yeah. Actually, I might be able to fall down here without taking too much damage. Because uh, it's it's designed to not kill them, and they have less health than I do. So. Uh, I heard another one make a noise, and I was confused because it looked like I killed them all. But yeah, uh, this is where I originally found the slimes, and I've got my slime room things directly underneath it, actually. Which, I have found, like, see here, I have found slimes in this, um, in this room. Not in that room. Um, so I'm not really sure if it's just them spawning in, like, that chunk over there, and then moving it, and then appearing in this one. Or what? So, yeah. But, uh, okay. So, I guess I'm gonna go kill some creepers and stuff, get some more gunpowder, and once I've got enough to make some TNT, I'm going to... Oh, look, it's almost nighttime. So that's, that's cool. Once I have enough gunpowder, I'm gonna make some TNT so I can just do that instead of having to mine out the entire... Um, pit like I did half of the last one because it's not fun to mine out that much crap so yeah I'll be back when I feel like I've got enough or when I feel like I've got some at least so yeah I'll be back okay I was just getting ready to go out and I decided I'd enchant myself some armor I did level 5 enchantments on all of them and I've got projectile protection 2 on my helmet projectile protection 1 on my chest plate Projectile protection 3 on my iron leg, or 2 on my iron leggings, and feather falling 2 on my boots. I don't really know what that does for my boots, but... Yay! And now I'm gonna go... kill some stuff. And I see nothing. I am on hard, right? Alright. <laughs> I've lit up most of my caves nearby, so... Um, it's not like we should have many, uh, out. Um, we shouldn't have any, like, any at all mobs spawning underground. So they should all be coming up here. But, uh, oh! No thanks. Stop it! I hate you. I mean, it's a good thing that I've got projectile protection <laughs> on, like, all of my equipment, but nonetheless, it's annoying. I like exploring at night. I should do it more often as, like, just whole episodes exploring at night. Um, or at least hunting, I should say, not necessarily exploring. Because, I, I don't know why, it's just fun. Um, especially once you've got, like, strength potions and you can run outside with a diamond sword and do tons of damage and... Owie. And a skeleton's killing him. I mean, a, yeah, a skeleton was killing himself on a on a cactus. That's what I was looking for. I don't know what exactly projectile protection does. I mean, well, obviously it protects me from projectiles, but I don't know how much exactly. And, and Enderman picked up some sand. I hate it when I'm just walking around and I find these little sand holes all over the place. Or, like, little holes in the ground all over the place. Because I know that the Endermen have come. And I know they're just toying with me. So much experience out here. I must have just killed a lot of things and not realized it. Whee. Um. Oh, this episode's almost over. I'll... Ow! Jerkface! Ow! 
hate skeletons. And because for some reason, like my computer's lagging because I'm recording, I guess. So I just can't sprint apparently. Um, because every time I try to double or double tap W, it just doesn't want to. And then it's very quick to think I let go, even if I didn't. So that's fun. I might just make a diamond sword just for just for kicks, because I've got 28 diamonds. So <laughs> you know, it never hurts to have a diamond sword with you. Ah! Oh my god! See, I'm. I should have hit him like three times there, but it just because I'm lagging is just totally skipping it. I want to fight those Endermen, but okay. I hate it when creepers get like in front of the row of enemies because then when you try to hit them, they just get pushed back towards you when they the, like the knockback from your attacks just pushes them into an enemy which pushes them forward so you end up just pushing the enemies towards you by attacking them okay all of those should have been crits but apparently rrr, apparently just didn't want to well wow, since skeletons are the only things hitting me and I've got so much projectile protection it looks like uh, my armor is going down very slowly Okay, now su there's supposed to be new sounds for Endermen. Um, like, well, I know there's new sounds, it's, but uh, there's supposed to be a staring one from what I saw on a video, so. No? You don't? You just don't care? Hey! Hey! Fine! You! Nope, he's just running at me. Which one was he? Oh, he's this one. Oh, jeez, I gotta go. Uh, thanks for watching, I'll see you next time.